Another day, another successful landing for the Solar Impulse aircraft. 11 days into their round the world flight sees them in Mandalay, Myanmar. The plane has now flown a total of nearly 4,500 kilometres without using a drop of fuel. And the idea of clean, efficient energy is a crucial one here. More than three quarters of Myanmar's population does not have regular access to electricity. ABB is now helping to bring solar power to rural communities here for the first time. Okay, the village Jiedrezi is uh, situated in Dadao Township, which is 45 minutes from town, and it has about uh, 110 households. And their main uh, business is agriculture. And uh, one of their main challenge is the electricity because they are far from the national grid. That's why we bring our solar project to this village. The solar battery charging stations here will be run by local women's groups, bringing not just electricity, but self-sufficiency. This project will distribute about 270 charging units to the household, where they, uh, where they contribute 1,000 charts per month to the women's group. So this is the place that we are going to install the solar panel for the whole village. Yeah, so there will be about 62 households come and charge in this place from the solar panel and then they would bring the battery back to their house. For locals it means a boost to almost every aspect of their lifestyle. This is just the latest in ABB's access to electricity programme, which has been running around the world for more than a decade now. It's this background in cutting-edge solar technology that's informed ABB's technological and innovation partnership with Solar Impulse. The solutions being applied here in Myanmar are, according to pilot Bertrand Picard, a sign that ABB is helping to make the Solar Impulse vision a reality.